Howdy, howdy, howdy. How y'all doing tonight? Savage, I'm going to throw you off the side of the road, I guess. Hopefully we get you a big hit. Sorry about the wait tonight, y'all. I don't know what's going on with Facebook. Just, just, I don't know. I just restarted the computer a couple times. Cleared the cache, did everything that I knew possible. I see that we got six people on here. I see Savage, Jackson, Temp, Cody, Jesse, so far in here. Give the other folks a few minutes. Temp, what's going on, brother? 
Yeah, you better pull over. You're going to be pulling over for a little bit. We've got four items to pull tonight. It's going to be one of the bigger breaks we've had in this room, so I'm excited for that. Hope you all are too. All the important people, right? Is that beachin' or bitchin'? <laughs> I don't know if beachin' is like a verb, or is that like a noun? I'm, I'm unsure of the uh, subject noun there. Texted Rigdon. Yeah, Rigdon would let me know that he never gets notifications from my room. He's, that fool's in here enough, you should know. There he is. So, Caleb, what's going on, brother? Sorry you didn't get your chiefs there. I saw you making a valiant effort. Amber slash Aaron are in the room now. Brock Lesnar needs to get in here. On the freeway, man. That's that's cool. 75 breaking with Big T. That's that's cool. There's Aaron. Mr. Barnum, what's going on, man? I knew Lu I know Lucero's not going to be able to hop in here tonight. He's got plans, prior engagements. That's cool. We all make mistakes. Just messing around. Let's see. Who will we miss him? Brock Lesnar. Louis? Did I see you in here? Maybe, possibly. No, I did not see you. I'm not on crack. No, Louis. No, AJ. AJ's probably busting out some wings at B Dubs now. No, Lucas. Give them a couple minutes to join in. That's what I like to do with that intro video. It just gives you guys a couple minutes to uh, get that notification that we're live and whatnot. You will text Swan. I thought I saw Swan in here already. He was one of the first people to hop in there, rigged in. I think. I mean, unless he left because he's bored already. He's here. Yep. Present and accounted for. It's like taking attendance in elementary school. Do you guys ever happen, have that happen to you when you're going through puberty and your teacher calls you for roll and you go, hey, Travis, you here? And you go, yeah, and your voice scratches really high. Yeah, I did that a couple times. That was embarrassing. Yo, Mr. Reynolds. Yeah, you want in on the next one? Yeah, I'm going to be ordering one more tonight or tomorrow. Probably going to do these one at a time just so I don't burn y'all out because they're such a high dollar high dollar item here. And they are getting to the end of the series too. So I might consider ordering two if you guys think we can fill two of them. Denise, I, I hope that didn't happen to you really hope that didn't happen to you otherwise I might be concerned for you so if you guys think I should order two think we can fill them I'm down for sure I'm down you know I'm I like doing this this is a hobby so Caleb says two all right Tim says two. Savage, you still with us? Making sure you didn't fly off the freeway there. And the ABQ. I do not, I already don't like I-25 here in Denver, but I especially do not like it in ABQ. Uh, yes, all right. Cool. Just making sure you're you're still with us. I don't need no more guardian angels in my life. All right, we'll go with two. I'm good with two. Uh, what 
a member of the group brought up to me today and it is an excellent idea is that we are going to do on the next one I'm going to do a spot limit for the first 24 hours which enables everybody to get an opportunity to get in the break after 24 hours it is fair game so most likely what I will do for 24 hours you have a limit of two spots that you can occupy after the post has been up for 24 hours spend as much money as you want up, up to you on what you want to hop in at so just just an FYI and I will put that in the post I will say spot limit two spots for 24 hours so that's new to the room that's only because this product is in high demand right now so yeah you guys are awesome this filled way 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 quicker than I ever expected so thank you guys for that I really appreciate it so it looks like we've got mostly everybody here so we will get started these guys have the 8x10 in it, it has the jersey and it has a mini helmet and a full size helmet order is going to be the 8x10 first I'm debating between mini helmet and jersey I'm flip flopping and obviously we're going to end with the full size helmet you guys tell me what you want to open second if you guys want uh, if you want the mini helmet or if you want the jersey second I'll look at comments as I'm doing the 8x10 here I saw a few proposals out there for trades, but nothing confirmed. I saw Lucero trying to work a trade, getting rid of the gross team that's in Philadelphia that nobody likes. And then I didn't see anything confirmed. Same thing with the Chiefs. So Jackson says pick mini jersey, big helmet. Cool with me. All right, this is the box here. I'm going to flip screen so I'm not going to see comments for a second here. So I, I can't see what I'm seeing here. This is the box here. We've got Des Bryant's box there, Drew Pearson's box there, or Michael Irvin's box there. Go Cowboys. We've got Tamper Proof Seal down there. We've got Tamper Proof Seal at the top there. We had, I'm going to flip screens again here. Mini second. Nobody likes the Eagles. Nobody. <laughs> um, starting with Jackson, he had the Texans, and ending with Jackson because he was like first and second. Oh, he got his team again. He got the Bears. The Bears. So if I missed any trades, I will need both people to comment on said trade and then. Uh, <clears throat> confirm it with me and just in case I missed it but I thought I was pretty on top of the comments so here we go Oop, I'm gonna lose it now <laughs> good luck everybody I'm gonna lose it with a knife in my hand that's awesome thanks for good TV all right, so let's see how they package these guys. As Dave and Adam do, they always throw a shit ton of stuffing in there. Okay, gonna set this down here. Alright, so 8 by 10. I am not too familiar with this guy. He is gonna be a little bit of an older guy here. No blood stains on the product. That's just how I authenticate my items here, Cody. I just like to try to give you guys hints and that's my thing. All right, so on this picture, it is inscribed with two-time Super Bowl champion, 
This team was dominant in the 80s and early 90s. And um, let's see here. It looks like he was primarily a DB. Nick play nickel and dime. Didn't didn't do much. He made a recovery in a Super Bowl. But anyways, let's see here. Welcome AJ. Yeah, someone saw it already. Who's got him? Who's got him? I missed him. Where are they? All right. So this is Daryl Pollard of the San Francisco 49ers. Daryl Pollard, San Francisco 49ers, which is inscribed two-time Super Bowl champs. I'm going to remove that banner so you guys can see it a little bit better. The glare is kind of throwing it off from the top loader there. Daryl Pollard, it's got the Dave and Adams. I always do this the wrong way. Dave and Adams shirt there. Dave and Adams shirt there. So the Niners, dude, you haven't been in this in forever. You always get the Niners, and you always win with the Niners. AJ, welcome back, man. You got yourself a Daryl Pollard signed 8x10. Congrats, my man. They must put the mini inside the full. Because I don't see it in here. I'm going to open the bag here and try not to reveal to me. Alright, so the mini is in there. We have got a current number one now receiver out of University of Southern California. He really made step forwards last year to becoming one of the better receivers in the league. Southern Cal. I really like this signature. It's one of my favorite signatures out in the league right now. Anybody have any guesses there? Caleb, my man, you got it right. Juju Smith Schuster of Pittsburgh. Juju Smith Schuster of Pittsburgh. There's the graph there. There's the JSA cert on the back. Sorry, I can never. I always do this backwards when I'm looking at the screen. There's your JSA cert. The other one's going to be at the bottom there. That is a big hit. Juju is one of the premier guys in the league now. He is making a turn for everything, or a turn for the better. He was not really. I think he was a second round pick for the Steelers, so he wasn't really. A first round gleamer. Steelers, Jason Savage, spot twenty five. Congratulations, my man, you're going you're getting a Juju Smith Schuster helmet shipped to you. Okay. Now with the jersey here, we've got a number one overall pick out of the other USC University of South Carolina number one overall pick just got attached with the franchise tag sounding like a robot I will tell, turn my audio down I might be talking too loud All right, so if anyone didn't hear, this is, for the jersey here, this is 
Number one overall pick, Ryan Reynolds, you got it. Jadavian Clowney of the Houston Texans. And this is not an on-the-field Nike jersey, but is a screen print Nike jersey from the Houston Texans. Jadavian Clowney, Houston Texans, which means that is going to be Jackson in spot one. Not a custom, but a Nike jersey. So congratulations, Jackson. Let's get a closer look at that signature there. I can't see. There's that. You got a JSA cert with that guy. That is a nice hit. That is a couple studs in the NFL right there. So... All right. And here we go for the full-size helmet. Let's see what we got. All right. I don't think I've ever seen it done this way. So we've got a running back who was a Super Bowl winner in 94. His nickname was Running. He got that from Chris Berman, if anyone knows that. He also was in the movie Any Given Sunday, if anybody knows that movie. Um, I don't know how well of a career he was, had, but he is a running back out of Notre Dame. Rigdon, you got it. Ricky Running Waters. That is a double San Fran hit. They typically do not put two of the same teams in these guys. But they did with this guy. So double San Fran hit Ricky Waters. There is the signature there. Nice clean helmet there. Got a JSA. Or I'm sorry, not a JSA, but it's got a Dave and Adam cert there. As well as SGC Authentic. I'm not familiar with that company, but David Adams is reputable. So that is nice. Nice clean Niners helmet there. Got the decals on both sides. That is a rep. Not a pro line, but a rep. Ricky Waters. Good job, Rigdon. Not a lot of people can get that one. So yeah, that is, damn, AJ, what is with you and the Niners in this group? I don't get that at all. That is another New Mexico sweep. I don't know what's going on in this room with New Mexico, but New Mexico takes the cake again. AJ with the Ricky Waters helmet there. And then we've got the Juju Smith-Schuster mini that went to Jason. And then the Jadavion with Jackson. And then the Daryl Pollard, I can't even remember his name because I'm not familiar with him. Daryl Pollard, 8x10. So that is the first. <laughs> there is a big Niners fan in here. Brandon Barnum is a Niners fan. So you might want to reach out to Barnum. I don't know how interested in the stuff he would be. But... You can reach out to him. I know he's a Niners fan, for show. I don't know if he's got any Finns gear for you, since you're a big Finns fan. But definitely that Juju and then that Jadavion were nice, solid hits out of this box. So that's going to wrap it up for this guy tonight. Uh, looks like I'm going to be ordering two more of these boxes, since you guys are wanting to do some more of this break. So two more boxes going to be on the way. They do three-day shipping, so they'll ship out tomorrow, and they'll come in next Wednesday or Thursday, depending on how quick they get them out. That wraps it up for the evening. Uh, thank you guys for filling that one so quick. I really, really appreciate it. I will be posting the other one as soon as I, as soon as I uh, order the other boxes. Congratulations to AJ, congratulations to Jason and Jackson. Those are those are some nice hits there. I always like to do, yeah, Lou is due for a hit. Um, 
I always like to do the full-size helmets. Full-size are my favorite things to do. So, again, guys, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Hope you guys have a good rest of your night. Peace out, hombre.